Hi everyone, it's late Friday afternoon. I'm running late with everything today. Um, I'm, this is just a random video that I'm doing um, because now this beautiful paper here, Steph has designed, I haven't released it yet. Um, I'll try and get that done tomorrow, by tomorrow. Um, I'll do a video and show you everything. But um, so two lovely ladies at on the same day, pretty much at the same time, one in the States and one in Australia, and you, uh, Rebecca and Lisa, asked if Steffi could design um, an architectural kit that was a little bit more masculine. Um, and so I gathered a whole lot of um, public domain sort of things, a lot from the Graphics Fairy, from the New York Public Library, um, and... And maybe I think some from the the Met Open Access program, and um, and so he came up with this these beautiful designs here, and um, I printed it a bit smaller because what I want to do um, anyway. So he came up with these designs. We kept it um, oh, um, we kept it a bit um, still vin like antiquey looking because that's the kind of style. So I think it all would mix in very well. Uh, with um the other kits as well like the italian ones as well um anyway i'm just dying to use it even though i haven't shown it to you yet and i've got these um recycled folders that i had um i, I had done kits a while back with these and this is um like a blue a blue file folder and i was thinking i might like to use that will i use that or other oh no it's under that mess there I was going to say I could use, um, I've got the covers. Wait, I might have one here. I do. And otherwise I could use this. Maybe I'll use this rather than cut up the file fold. Yes, this is even thicker. So this is just from an, a notepad. Um, so what I'm going to do is make myself a little notebook. And I'll tell you what it's for. So I'll put that aside. I want to do something more exciting with that, I think. So basically... Um, I'm going to sort of cover that, but I might leave a little edge around it and stitch it so you can see the, the straw paper. So let's just get some glue on that. Like, oh, Steffi, uh, just a minute. I'll put it on pause and I'll add the two videos okay, I'm back. Oh, my gosh, it was those annoying people. I can't stand them. The ones, you know, I don't know if they do it in other countries, but in Italy, the all of the different sort of um you can hear me i've got gas in my voice i'm oh, huffing and puffing with annoyance um oh, they have been buzzing our doorbell all day um it's you know the energy supplier people and and they trick you like they say oh we're gonna you know give you these cheaper prices and blah 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 and then and then you discover all of these hidden costs it's just ridiculous so i said to stefano let's just I prefer to stay, like it's happened with the telephone and the internet and then all of a sudden, you know, um, all of these hidden costs appear and the internet doesn't work anymore and it, oh, it drives me bananas. So it was one of those silly men from um, the electricity, different electricity and he says, oh, oh, I said, I, well, I'm not interested, you're just trying to sell us and get us to move from our company that we are where we are and that's reliable. And you're just trying to sell us something we don't want. And he said, "No, no, I've got to, I've got to reduce your tariff." And I'm like, "Well, if if you're going to re you reduce your, our tariff, then you would do that. You just reduce it. Why wouldn't you just reduce it? And and um and and do it via email. Like it's very budgy. They just want to come in the house and they make you sign things that you don't want to sign. And I'm just not de talking to them." I just think it's a very odd way of doing things and a waste of... Oh, I've gone crooked. Well, I'll have to trim that off. It was just for me anyway. What the fuck does it matter? Oh, I'm very upset that that man disturbed my video. What a rat. I just have no patience for people who are trying to sell me things I don't want. Okay, so, look, it's very strong. Very, very strong. Good. Okay, great. So what I'm, oh, I didn't tell you what I'm making. So I'm making myself a little book, a little book, as my granny used to say from the north of England. A little book. Um, Wendy, you gave me this. I can't find my little blue thing. It fell in, it fell in that hole where the scissors are, that big pit of scissors. 
and I have to pull them all out. You know, it take me two years to do that um, to find where. Oh, there it is. But it's right down there. I'll probably slice my fingers. Off. There it is. Got it. I forgot that it was down there. Got it. Got it. Oh, thank heavens for that. Found it. Okay, so um, well, I don't even know where the middle is. Does it matter? I might need. Do I need a spine? I think I might like just the feeling of a little spine. Actually, I should do it that way. Now, let me just see how big it is. I, oh, I don't know. What am I doing? What am I doing? So this is what I'll do. I'll just eyeball it. I'll, 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 I'll boil it. I'll boil it. So I think that'll be about... But I don't want to go in the middle. Do I? Don't know. It's all too hard. I don't like measuring. I have to think I have to measure. Might have to measure. Don't enjoy doing that. 25 and a half. What's half of 25 and a half? Oh, God, that's complicated, isn't it? 12.75, isn't it? Oh, Rachel couldn't do something easier. 12.75, so that's about there. Right, well, I'm just going to eyeball it. I'm just going to go... That's about halfway, so I need to go here. No, not confident at all. Um, if I go there, I've got... 13 and oh wait if I go there there 13 and if I go there I've got 12 so I can't I've got to go here 12 and a half and here you're probably saying what are you doing I'm just going to go down here right down there that's where I'm going I'm sure I'm doing this the wrong way I never understood the um, pits and the valleys I must say this is just a really, really wheezy little project. Okay, so that's my, it's gonna work. It'll, it'll fold, don't worry. Even if I've done it the wrong way, we'll get it to go. Because I'm very determined, if you hadn't noticed. Very determined. And that silly man woke up, poor Steffi, he's sick. He's got a cold and he was having a rest because he'd been helping me do things all morning even though he wasn't feeling well. There we go. That's not very much in the middle, is it? I can just trim it off a little bit. It's not the end of the world. I'll just trim it. That's what I'll do. I'll trim it. Okay, so that's that. And now I still haven't told you. I've thrown my glue book on the floor because I need to get it out of the way. I've got stuff everywhere because I'm going to... Oh, no, wait. See, I haven't planned anything. I need to stitch around it, but first, you know what I need to do? I need to put something... Well, I'll actually just collage over that because I like the straw paper. Straw paper, recycled paper, whatever. Okay, so I'm just going to zigzag around there. Actually, no, first I'm going to trim that off. Where's my trimmer? This is very haphazard crafting, guys. Very haphazard. If you wanted a um, very... Just a minute. If you wanted an organised video... This is not the one for you. As it's just for me, I'm not concerned about it. It's just something that I'm going to keep. Um, but if it were obviously for a customer, I would make sure I did it properly. Okay, now I'm going to stitch around the paper. You can turn the volume down if you don't like it. Another very whizzy way to make a, a little um, journal or notebook. Okay. Isn't that lovely paper? I just love it. Okay. Then the next thing I want to do is love that okay I want to gather up some pieces of paper that I've got flying around and what I want to do is this book is going to be where I'm going to write as neatly as possible um, with my very bad 
right handwriting um all of the wonderful um, let me repeat wonderful um 100 day inspired uh, 100, 100 day project inspired by ideas you've all been sending me uh, uh, they're just a fan they're just fantastic now i might not be able to do all of them i've still got to go and write down some but i've been writing them down in a very messy fashion i don't like that photograph i'm actually i might even I'm, i'll glue something on there because that's it's violent um so I'll, i think i'll put that in there and cover it up um yeah just amazing ideas so i was thinking i might not be able to um get them all done in the 100 day project because there's a lot of really great i might keep that a lot of really great um ideas but um i want to write them down in this book is what i want to do um and i'll number them i'm going to write the person's name down because what i was thinking is they are ideas that can be done even not in the 100 day project i might need bigger pages than those there's a lot of ideas to write down but i'd like it to be just all different pages different size pages if you know what i mean i might I might, you know, I'm, I'm going to keep this book too. It's going to be my 2020 100 day project ideas book. And I'm just going to, as I said, I'm going to go in there and pull out each week what I did, or each day. What am I saying each week? Each day. Oh, yes. I have to remember every day. Um, you know, the idea that I'm going to whip out each day um, for the 100 day project. Let's tear this one down. This was when I did the stamping for... Okay, that's... So I've got to tear it about there. I mean, this is the biggest... Um, <laughs> slap it together. Let's just slap it together. Journal. Look, my glue even flopped upside down. Just really... Well, actually, I could probably use that as well. Really just chucking it together as fast as I can. Because um, I need to get writing because see I'm measuring here there's a lot to there's a lot of already I've written pages but they're messy and so I wanted I'm we're going to Florence tomorrow so I want to um sit down um like you know I wake up very early in the morning so when I'm at the hotel I just wake up and I thought I'll just you know quietly sit while the others are snoozing and um and I folded it in the wrong spot I'll have to trim that bit off too. Um, I told you it's very, very bodgy, bodgy, nifty crafting. I know I'm, I'm totally off screen now. I've, I've pushed myself off screen. I'm, I'm getting back onto screen, don't worry. Um, yeah, so I thought I'll be able to just sit down because I've slapped, you know, just quickly written the ideas down in a very messy fashion, as I said. Um, and so I, what I'll do... Um, is write them very neatly and small and put them in this book we're going to decorate it too i think we're going to decorate it so i'm just going to grab and i'll fold this again let's measure it why don't we measure it what a good idea rachel measure wouldn't that be the smart thing to do and i'm going to keep that flipping out so I can extend my writing further beyond the limits of the book. Uh, I'm in a very silly mood. Haven't been, this is the first time I've been able to get in my craft room all day. Let's just say that. First time I've gotten in here. So I'm, uh, I think I'm a little bit overexcited about being in here. And I've actually got to stop in a minute and go and cook dinner, which is a, which is a blow. Dinner's a bit of a pain in the you-know-what. So... But anyway, it's not a difficult dinner, so then I'll be able to come back in while it's cooking away. So let me just see. I probably need, I need quite a lot of pages. So they're quite boring pages because I really just want to write my my list. List. Yes, my list. So I'm going to fold that that way. I'm just throwing a few, you know, a few old recycled sort of pages. And I'll have to collage onto that one so I can write on it. Oh, I should put some straw paper in too, shouldn't I? And then we'll put that one in there. Oh, that's perfect, that one. And we'll put this one in here. I wasn't going to use that. That's good for something else. 
and I'll collage onto this one, I think. Do I want to get that complex? Yes, why not? So I slip that one into there. So mostly plain pages, obviously, because we've got to write on them. Well, I have to write on them. Put that one in there. I think that one's too wide too. Oh no, that's going to be okay, I think. Let me have a look. Yes, that's going to be fine. Um, I'll cover that up. Christmas, we're not doing Christmas, are we? Put that in there. Now, what else did I want to include? I wanted to include some other types of paper. Um, oh, some straw paper. <laughs> Just let me stand up for a second. Just grabbing, oh no, that's got something. What I've got here in this box is a whole lot of stuff. You know, when I um, make my journals and I put too much stuff in and I have to rip out pages, well, this is it. So just let me see what's in here that I might be able to use. Things that have been ripped. That was from a little journal. Oh, I might throw that in there, why not? And... Um, See, I keep them, obviously, because um, I will use them somewhere else. These have all been stitched around. But this is where they go when I take them out. Unless I, I sort of tear them like that was torn. We'll have some pretty things, and we need a little bit of pretty. I could probably tear that one down. What's on the other side? But I don't want to feel... I need to be able to write on most sides. So I can write there. We'll put that in. There's a good one. And it really doesn't... Oh, that's got stuff stitched. See, these ones I just tore out. I don't know what's happened to that. Christmas. We don't want Christmas. So just going through... Oh, that, there's a whole book already made. And I can always have two. I don't have to have one if I find... Um, I've got, you know, too many ideas to write down. I could always have two, couldn't I? There's no rules to say that I have to have one. So I'll put in as many pages will fit. And then if I need to, I'll make another one. How about that? So, wait, I've got another one here. So I used to, when I first started making journals, I used to, prepare, like, you know, tear up all my pages and put them in these buckets and then I just pull them out and it was actually quite a good system and then I don't know why but I stopped doing it look at all these wonderful book pages that are in here that I could be using hmm. oh snoopy pages let's use some snoopy pages oh look at that I might have to send that to you when actually I'm going to pull that out I'm sending that to Wendy what that won't be a surprise Wendy um but that's coming to you because it just reminds me of you um and just, I know I've got other plain pages here. Just a second. Let's get to them. That's an old page. I'm going to put that in there. I think I need to sort these boxes out, really, don't I? Because there's lots of um, book pages and things in there. Because I kept some in, because I do put um, book pages, but quite often I put the original book pages in. That's a nice piece. We'll put that in there. And I'll just be using my biro. There's more nice old book pages. Um, yes, I'll just be using my... Oh, they're those beautiful botanicals. I hoard those. I don't know why. I've got a second book. I've got two. I bought two. I've, you know how I say you always buy two if you love it. Oh, those. I haven't ever used those. Oh, here's a piece of straw paper. That's what I was looking for. Straw paper. That's what I was looking for, those. I've got these. I haven't done anything with these. These are from 1900. And they are illustrated... Look at, look, at the, look at the state of them. I didn't remember they were in there. I have to take those out of there. Um, they're about Italian history. Okay. Talk about the bodgiest crafter ever. I mean, seriously. I mean, how can you craft like that? Okay, so we've got these sensible pieces of paper. We'll call the, the plain papers the sensible ones. And I won't use those. I'll use these because they're the right size. We'll put that lovely old bit in there. And let's have a let's just slip in here and there something that's pretty like that one. And I'm going to fold that one. So this is where all of your ideas are going for the 
2020. Roxy. 100, I was going to say 1,000 day project. Wouldn't that be fun and fresh? Um, 100, and day, 100 and day project. So all my chickens are not feeling well today. Oh, dearie me. And we're going to Florence tomorrow and they're both coming to Florence not feeling the best. I'll slip that one in there and we can put... Oh, I can hear the trumpet going. Toot, toot. And we'll put that one in the front. Okay. Now let's see. Lots of pages. <laughs> Lots of ideas. No, but my writing's quite... Um, I don't write in teeny tiny ways. So um, I want to make sure I have enough pages. Um, and that, you know, it can fit. Now my idea was I was going to machine stitch. I don't know if my machine's going to enjoy that quite a lot of pages to get through I don't know I think I better um, do the pamphlet stitch why don't we do that so what a really quick whizzy um, notebook I'm not even going to well I should measure shouldn't I but I'm not going to I'm being very bad crafter today very bad I'm going to grab my clips though that's a good idea I know lots of people don't clip but I like to clip them in place and I'm not going to measure. I'm just going to, now that, because I'm just going to go through the whole lot, I hope. Now, where's my thing? Here. Okay, I'm just sort of going to eyeball the centre. And go for it. And if it doesn't go right through, then what will I do? I will get my book all and um, I'm going to capture that page as well. And we'll just push it through. Although it does, it does make it. Um, it's not very nice on the other side when you do that, but it doesn't matter. So these could be a really. I mean, obviously you would do it with a lot more care than me, but they'd be a nice little gift for someone. Just trying to. Get my hole going. There we go. Now we need our blunt, our blunt needle. What colour would I like? It's not very good, but it doesn't matter. I think I like oh, that's my favourite colour. Maybe I'll use this one. There's my needle. So we'll just do the three hole. That's all I know how to do. <laughs> that's why we, we do the three hole pamphlet stitch because that's all I know. So I could watch a video and learn another one, couldn't I? That would be interesting. Come on. Don't tell me you've all jiggled about. So there's that hole. They must have moved. There we go, in there. So you go down the centre, because mine's going to tie inside. So in that way, up through this one. You go right across here, because there's lots of newbies. Right across there, like so. And then you come here. So that's a really whizzy little notebook. So write your ideas down. And because I'm messy, I didn't want anything too precious. Tie your thing and then you could leave them long and attach something if you wanted to. Uh, I, I think I'll trim them off. I wasted a bit there. I don't normally. I normally... Um, just um, you know, pull them so that I'm not wasting any. But I did there, so that's put that away. Okay, so that's my book. My pages are. It's not, I mean, it's not perfect, but it's it'll do the job. Now, let's have a look at it. See, I like it. Nice, interesting pages in there. Mix of old and new. Love it. Get rid of that. What will I put there? I need to write there though. I would love to put that there. I think I'm just going to do it. Get my glue book that I chucked on the floor. That is 1700s, that piece of paper. I think it needs to be stored somewhere, but I'm going to keep it.
maybe I won't write on that page. See, this can be my little list and then I can even um, just, if I feel like it, decorate a page or two because I've put lots of pages in there. Very fragile paper, that one. Some of it stuck to my fingers. Love that. And then I can, um, where's my box? I haven't looked in here for a while. I could see, oh, I didn't know I had those in there. Oh, I had those in there too. Oh, and I had that in there. I could stick her there. I like her. Help if I move those out of the way, huh? This is just the most random video, guys. Really, just not planned at all. Just, I decided I needed to do it. Lots of nice things here. Ooh. Oh, <coughs> excuse me. These are carols from Caroline's um, shop on Etsy. Oh, I might stick a few of those around. I'm going to make it pretty, don't I? Well, let's do that. Why don't we just do that? That's my video, is to make this look pretty. I've got, I've got all these pictures, things. Oh, I've got all these nice things in here that I didn't even know. Oh, these are Caroline's, I think. She's got these. I can't remember what you call them. I really like those. I haven't used those yet. I did print them out, you see, but I didn't use them yet because I forgot about them. Okay. Oh, I just feel like doing something random today. I need to do another video because I want you to have another video on the weekend. I probably won't get two videos done unless I get up early in the morning. But I needed to do with some exercises too. I don't know. It's not enough time in the day. There's just not enough time. Have a whinge, Rachel. Okay. Well, I don't know. There's not. There's all of these wonderful things from Caroline. Now let me. Caroline, sorry, not Caroline. Carol. Carol is Carol's name, <laughs> and Caroline is her shop. Okay. Oh, I think I like that there. I think I'm going to put that there, and then I can write. You see, if I need to. try and get another what video will I try and do I could do another marguerite number three or I could do oh I forgot to put snoopy paper in oh well when I say snoopy paper it's just grid paper but it's yellow it's a love it's actually a really nice yellow it's a yellow that I like it's a buttery yellow there we go stick that down there where's that lady going do I want the lady I don't think so anymore. I don't think I want the lady anymore. No. Oh, but I can see that there. You see, I don't want to see that. I think I'll stick something like that down there. Maybe a bit of music paper. See, this, like, this is what you could do. Like, this could be a gift for someone and you could just decorate a few pages here and there but not um you know you don't have to put lots of pockets or anything like that because it's just a notebook and it you know like if you're going somewhere like we're going to florence tomorrow but i won't use it there like i'm going to use it for my list but if you're going away for a weekend you could just have one of these and maybe like what jessica um what i bought from jessica have a few pocket things um flippy things but um you could um, have those and then you just stick your ephemera in them. That sort of thing too. Put that there, no. Okay. Well, that's very nice, isn't it? Okay, so then let's look at the front. On the front, I was thinking... Mm. So I did have some thoughts. It's not completely random. Um, not that... Oh, no, I can't show you that. That's not ready yet. Um, I was thinking... I've got all these flowers cut out. I was wondering if I would just like a flower, but I don't know if I've got the right flower. See, I would like a flower stuck on there. 
and then a, a, maybe a label somewhere. And as you can see, I've just been dying to, um, have, you know, just use a piece of Steffi's new papers that he's designed. Like, oh, I like that colour more. I feel like it needs that because that's long and narrow. It needs something else. But I don't have too many flowers cut out because I need to sort of sit down and, and get onto it. I do like that though. I'm going to snip those off. I'm going to stick those down. Um, and then I feel like it needs something else. I've got this brown paper that Jessica's journal came in. Let's have a look at that. It's quite thick. It's quite a thick paper. Am I recording? Mm. I hope so. Oh, I've got to remember I've got to join the other part of the video on too because that could be a bit of a thing, couldn't it? I think I'll just glue that on. Okay, and then this one there, I'm going to cut that off. I can't remember what book I cut these cut these out of. Love that. See, they're quite um. They're more masculine, the pages, but um, that's stiff design, but you can, you can pretty them up. Yep, so you might think that's a lot of, um, a lot of pages, but I've already got more than, I think more, like way more than 50 because this morning I was writing down everybody's comments about um, if I've put like on your comment, then you'll know that I've already written it down. Um, I was up to 50 and there's more and I haven't, I'm not up to date yet. So um, I like that. Isn't that gorgeous? And I want to put a label. I saw I had a label in, in the glory box. Here it is. Let's get a label. I had a label here somewhere. Did I pull it out? I may have... Oh, no, here it is. I don't know if I want that one. Well, I don't mind that one, actually. Where would I want to put it? I'd like it up there, but I don't want to cover that. Maybe I'll put it there. That's where I'll put it. And I'm going to write the 100 Day Project 2020 Ideas. No, I'm going to write Inspired By. That's what I'm going to write. Inspired By. Because that's our theme this year. I should make a little mini one too, um, where I write down everybody's ideas, the other ideas for the theme for the 100 day project. So that, I like that. There we go. And then um, maybe before I publish this video, I'll publish the, the kits as well. So that way um, that's done. So that's that. Now, do we want... Oh, I need. I know what I needed to do. I needed to fix up this bit here. I wasn't happy. I don't want to keep that. So I've got this scrap here that could go there. So I'll start off with that. I can't believe I forgot my Snoopy paper. It's just vintage. It's just from... I think it might even be... Well, good on you, Rachel. Um... It might be from the 70s, that paper. This is totally recycled, this. Except for the couple. Of, well, it is recycled because those were flop bits that didn't go into journals. Well, not flop bits. They were excess. I think I'll... It's like a, no, I won't bother putting that on. I don't need it. And then... What will I put? I'm going to put one of Carol's. Maybe one of Carol's. Um, one of Carol's 
doesn't cover it. Right, let's just cut it out. Won't take too long. This is not a complex um, doily to cut out. Oops, sorry guys, got tangled in my cord. I need, if I put something down there, I might like it. See, put something down there, it's better. I did need that to go up further. What a goose that I got stuck to my finger and ripped. Let's have a look. I think I'll glue that down because I did like it going up further. one down here. I think I'll change my page. Everything gets so sticky so quickly. Oops, rip that one up too. Okay. And I can write on there if I want to. I might even stick. It's fun just doing what you want to do. Get that out. Um, oh, there was another label there. And let me see if there's anything here. Oh, I like that. I think I'm going to stick that there. I like that. Yep. Okay, so that's that. And then we'll just flip through, see if there's anywhere else that I feel like I need to put something. But it's really, as I said, just for writing this little booklet. Put that there. And then... Okay, oh, I like that. Do you like it? So let's just have a look. Lots of pages in there to write in. I could do something in the front. Do something here. So let's just have a quick flip. Love that. Here. I'm not sure about here. I could. I can still write there, you see. So I don't want to um, make it too busy. So I've got, oh, well, I don't probably enjoy writing on these so much. Although I like it. Oh, I like that. Okay. Is that one or two? How are you feeling, Steffi? Good. Good now that you had a little snooze? Better? Yes, I'm better. better. Look what I'm doing. What so Stefano doesn't know about what I'm doing for the 100. So for the 100 day project, I'm doing inspired by... And Sarah had this great idea that um, I should ask um, my subscribers or whoever, my viewers, I should say, because not maybe not everybody subscribed, um, to give me their what they would like me to be inspired by, whether it might be a colour or an animal or another person. Um, so be inspired by bees or be inspired by coral colour or be inspired by... Gail or be inspired by Wendy, um, that sort of thing. So yeah. everybody's been writing their comments on the video uh -huh. and I started writing them down in a very messy fashion in my big book. Uh -huh. So I thought I'd make myself a little book ah. to put all the ideas in. Nice. 
Nice. And so when I'm doing the 100 day project, I'll just have this little book here. Uh, that's what they did. Yeah. <laughs> that, so then I thought, well, I've been dying to you. We haven't published your <coughs> kits yet that you work so hard on. And I was, I love them. And so I thought I'd just make myself a little book. Cool. So you can use it tomorrow. So I'm going to take it to Florence. Good. And I'm going to, I've, I'll take the pages where I've written very messily the ideas and I'll just write them all down in here. That's a good idea. Yeah, it's a good idea. And I'm going to put like um, 2020, the 100 day project inspired by. Oh, cool. And then that's going to have all my subbies or nice. my viewers yeah. ideas written in there. So, um, yeah, that's what I'm doing. But I'm just decorating it a little bit, just a little bit, not too much. Because I had to cover a few things up. So there you go. You're up to speed now. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. No, not you, Steffi. Huh? People watching. Because okay. I'm videoing. Okay, good video. <laughs> good video. <laughs> Don't know about that. It's very bodgy. Okay. There we go. I actually should have brought in some more of the pages and put some of the um, Steph's pages in there, but I didn't. And I think I might even use some of Carol's um, little... Isn't that pretty on there? Yeah, I've got lots of space. I can put things about that I like, that I want to remind me of, that I want... Yeah, I want to remember. So I'm going to trim off those bits, and I'm just going to stick that down. Might as well make it a pleasure to look at. So, oh gosh, I don't know what I have to remember to link in this video. What do I have to remember to link? Oh, I know. I'll link the video where if you're new and you haven't seen the thoughts about the 100 day project. So you can watch that video and leave your comment there if you want to give me suggestions. And um, I'll link carol's shop because she has some really lovely digital kits and she also has beautiful um napkins if she hasn't sold out on of all of them and um and and quite often she has wonderful um she the cat's mother has wonderful um digis uh not digis what am i saying coffee dyed things that she's done i need to cover up this little bit here so i can write there i've got a piece of Oh, that's good. That's just a piece of coffee dyed paper that was just sitting right here. Hopefully I'm on screen. I think so. Have you ever seen such a whizzy little book? This is just a whiz. I'd like to make more of these. I, I, that's what I think might, you know, I always do these big involved projects. I need to do some fast, little fast fun things as well. There we go. Fast fun things are good too. And I think there's nothing nicer than um, using something that you've you've made or someone's made for you. Get any glue there. As you know, I don't like gluing those things down, and I've got to put a little bit there. So what will I put there? I'm sure I've got something flying around that I can glue down there. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Such a mess. I really next week when you know after the weekend when I get back in here, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to do a clean out and start the week tidy. I think. Yep, start the week tidy. Oh my goodness, I just remember something else I have to do. I could put that there. No, I don't want that there that away um <laughs> let me see oh here, wait here you go here's my scraps this is where i where i should be looking in here lots of good stuff in here i want cardstock maybe a piece of no i don't want that maybe that piece yeah i think i like that something like that they're just plain not too much, like a slightly different color, color to the page that's there, but not too different. I don't want the shiny side. Okay, great. 
and then so we'll just quickly go through here that's all good probably even right over that if i need to oh here i didn't like that where's the other part the violent page we have to cover up the violent page where's the other half where is it that's not it can't find it oh well oh wait if i go like that i'll find it there it is Okay, so I need to cover that little bit up too. Um, and this scrap here of one of my old letters. I wonder if I might like, I'll put that there. Um, oh, I've got this too. What about this here? Let's get rid of that. Oh, yes, I think that's better. You know, it's a little bit see-through. It doesn't matter. Some vigorous gluing going on today. So I hope everybody is well. And I know I wanted to say thank you for all of the ideas. I am loving, absolutely loving reading all of your ideas for the 100 day project and thank you so much to my um, dear sister who came up with such a fun suggestion um, that really does involve everybody who wants to be involved i think that's really fun it makes it even you know more fun when i'm doing it um i'll say um blah -de blah and maybe it might some of them um there's lots of great ideas in there some of them may overlap with each other um, so I'll try my best. I'll try my best when I've got this. That's why I want to write it out neat. I'll try my best to go through um, this list. Maybe I'll glue this super old page down. Um, I'll try my best to go through this list um, and write down um, everything. You know, like if, if, if more than one person suggested bees or something like that, I'll try my best to go through and see everybody who wrote bees and and you'll, you will be all mentioned um, when I do the bees or something like that, if you know what I mean. Now, this is curling up, so I'll have to... Oh, and it's too wide. So what I might do is just put, I'll put that there. I've got really sticky fingers. I really do need to. And what I'm going to do is... Go like this put some glue here and just fold it over I like doing that I mean, talk about wing it just take that little bit off I need to get some glue under there There we go. And if anything's annoying me, I'll just tear it off. Okay, so I've got that there. Very old book page covering those violent men. Get some more glue there. And I'm just going to put something else as well. Okay. Oh, I would like that if it was bigger. Here's a bigger one. Okay, great. And thank you to um, those of you... Ah, that's the other thing, bit of business I needed to do. Thank you. I wanted to say, first of all, thank you to everybody who subscribed to my mailing list. And I'll tell you why the mailing list is important is because, as I said before, if anything happens, that's the only thing that is really kind of like mine, in inverted commas. Um, and if anything happened to any of the other platforms, um, I've got my mailing list. And I can contact you there and say where I am. or And I've also got the blog. I don't do much on the blog anymore because I just don't have time. Um, yeah, uh, yeah, I just don't have time. And I kind of enjoy the more visible sort of um, aspect of, um, you know, YouTube and being able to explain better and that sort of by speaking. Isn't that pretty? I think I might put that there. Um so yeah so but the mailing list is good and it and that's where i'm going to be sending i'm 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 going to try and be good and every month maybe occasionally every two months um i'll send out a freebie as often as i can um 
you know, sometimes I'm more busy, sometimes I might not be able to get them done, but I'll try my best. Um, so that's mainly what I'm going to use my mailing list for. And um, then maybe, I'd want, I don't know, if I get, get become more organized, I might be able to use it for other things as well. Um, but um, yeah, so thank you everybody who subscribed. And what I might do now, because I, I found my link that I had um, to the link that I had that you can use to just directly subscribe instead of going to the blog. So I found that link. So what I'll do is, um, which side do we like the best? Do we like that side or that side? I think I like that side, but then I'll put it, have to put it like that. That's okay. Um, I'll, I might put that link, you know, I always say you can find me here. Um, and I put my blog and Instagram and I think I put Facebook or Etsy or both. I can't remember. Um, but what I might do is I'll put the, um, you know, subscribe to my email, my email list there. That's what I'll do. And that way it's easier for those who want to subscribe um, to find. Now, sometimes it's funny things happen when you're trying to subscribe. Like, it, I don't know, it doesn't work. Um, I know that you have you have you receive an email. Um, I can't really control it sort of thing. I can check. I can check um, if your email is there um, for you if you if you have a doubt. Um, but normally you have to confirm. Once you subscribe, you have to confirm that that's what you wanted to do. And, and, you know, don't be afraid. I, those who've been subscribed for a long time know that I don't use it very often, but I'm going to be using it a bit more. But really, mostly, my, unless I need to tell you something like, you know, something news happening, um, I mostly will be using it just for, uh, what's, it, what's it called? Um, freebies. There you go. Freebies. It's just because I'm working while I'm talking, so I'm just, you know... Words are eluding me. Okay, nearly done. Don't know if I'm on screen or not. Nearly, nearly done. And I might use something like that on that one. So I've got very sticky fingers, so I don't think cutting will be fun, but I'll, I'll just trim off all the knobbly bits because I don't have time for fussy, fussy cutting. Just quick. Okay, so I think I'll put that, I like I like to trim them off, I like them to sort of come off the page a little bit, so I think I'll just you know, trim it there, like that, and then I'll glue that down, and we should be done, actually, I don't think there were that many pages that I had to cover up. There we go, that's good, and let's have a look. all good I'm gonna leave the bird yep that's good so let's just quickly flip through so this is going to be my 100 day project book I'm leaving that because it's pretty I don't know if I really want to put anything now I'll decide I might leave that I won't start writing there I'll start writing here and that I'll decide at a later date if I want to do something to it so I've got all these pages where I can write everybody's ideas down and it's fairly nice to look at oh I didn't put any anything else on the pages but I can do that as I go as I feel like so there we go some um, read you know pages that were left out of journals good way to use them up it's great lots of pages to write in there and then as I said I can make more or I could add a pocket and put a little booklet in with the other. I, you know, I think I would like them more written down on pages and not on flip outs or anything like that. So there we go. Isn't that pretty? And that's Steffi's new paper. So that is my video. And I'm going to go off and get start cooking dinner. And, um, and then I hope I will be able to get something else done today. But it's already night time. It's dark outside. So... Um, I might have to do an after dinner video. I don't know. Oh, we just, Lily wanted to watch a James Bond. We might watch a James Bond. We'll see. Okay. So thank you for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.